In 2017, astronomers detected something extraordinary. An interstellar object, later named Yumuom, Muo had entered our solar system. It was fast, it was strange, and it defied expectations. Two years later, a second interstellar object, Comet 2 I Boroso, confirmed that a more mole wasn't a fluke. Now, in 2025, it has happened again. A new object has appeared on the radar, and this one is called 3I Atlas. Unlike a MO, which we noticed five days after it flew past Earth, this time we're ready. Spotted on July 1st, 2025, and listed by the International Astronomical Union's Minor Planet Center, 3I Atlas raised eyebrows in the astronomical community. It first showed up in the near-Earth object confirmation page flag for follower. But this wasn't just another rock on a long elliptical orbit. The moment astronomers began fitting a trajectory, the signs were clear. This object isn't from around here. Prepare yourselves. We begin. On July 1, 2025, astronomer Larry Dino clicked submit on what looked like another ordinary rock floating through space. The object appeared as a faint dot against the star fields, magnitude 18.8 over two million times dimmer than the North Star. But this dot was moving. Not the lazy drift of a typical asteroid, but something urgent, purposeful. The preliminary calculations made Dano pause. The object's speed suggested it wasn't gravitationally bound to our sun. Think of it like a baseball thrown so hard, it escapes Earth's gravity entirely, never to return. Atlas operates as part of a global network designed to protect Earth from cosmic threats. Every night, its powerful cameras capture images of the same patches of sky, comparing new photos with previous ones to spot anything that has moved. Most detections turn out to be main belt asteroids following predictable orbits or near-Earth objects on well-understood paths that pose no immediate danger. The system processes thousands of observations each night flighting objects for human review based on their motion and brightness. When Dino reviewed the latest batch, this particular object stood out not because it was bright or large, but because its motion didn't fit the expected patterns. Within hours, observatories across the globe were turning their instruments toward this mysterious visitor. The Minor Planet Center flagged it as a near-Earth object, initially cataloged as a 1 pi 3 z. The designation looked routine, but the numbers told a different story. The first follow-up observations came from telescopes in Arizona, where the Catalina Sky Survey team quickly confirmed the object's unusual trajectory. David Rankin captured clear images, showing the visitor as a distinct point of light moving against the background stars. His photographs would become some of the first documented evidence of this cosmic wanderer. As more observations poured in from facilities around the world, the picture became clearer and more extraordinary. This object was traveling at 66 kilometers slash as relative to our sun, far exceeding the 42 kilometers slash as needed to escape our solar system forever. It was moving faster than any known asteroid or comet should move if it belonged here. The European Space A's planetary defense team immediately took notice. Their telescopes in Spain and Chile began tracking the object, adding crucial data points to determine its precise trajectory. Each new observation refined the calculations and strengthened the case for something truly remarkable. The astronomical community buzzed with excitement. Could this be another interstellar visitor like the mysterious Oumuamua that had captivated the world in 2017? The trajectory calculations suggested something even more extraordinary. This wasn't just another interstellar object. It was moving faster and following a more extreme path than any visitor astronomers had ever detected. Professional astronomers began requesting emergency telescope time, knowing they might be witnessing a once-in-a-generation discovery. Amateur observers started sharing the coordinates on social media, mobilizing a global network of sky watchers to help track this cosmic messenger. Next, we dive deeper into the moment astronomers realized they were witnessing something unprecedented. 
The breakthrough came when citizen scientist Sam Dean started digging through archive telescope data. Working late into the night from his home computer, Dean began systematically searching through weeks of Atlas observations, looking for earlier glimpses of the mysterious object that had just captured the world's attention. His persistence paid off in spectacular fashion. Deep in the archives, Dean discovered clear images of a 11P I3Z dating back to June 25th. These weren't random lucky shots, but a systematic trail of observations that had been sitting unnoticed in the data for over a week. Each image showed the object progressing along its path, a cosmic breadcrumb trail waiting to be discovered. These pre-discovery observations transformed everything. Astronomers thought they knew about the visitor. With six full days of tracking data instead of just hours, the orbital mechanics calculations became dramatically more precise. The margin of error shrank from wild estimates to mathematical certainty. With the extended data set, astronomer Ye Quanji located even earlier observations from the Zwicky Transient Facility dating back to June 14th. The trail now stretched across nearly three weeks, providing an unprecedented baseline for calculating the object's true trajectory through space. The refined calculations revealed numbers that made seasoned astronomers pause in disbelief. The object's eccentricity measured 10.4 plus or minus just 1.1. In astronomical terms, this number represents something almost beyond comprehension. Our Earth follows an orbit with an eccentricity near zero, meaning we travel in an almost perfect circle around the Sun. Even the most elongated comets in our solar system rarely exceed an eccentricity of three. An eccentricity above one means the object follows a hyperbolic path, entering our solar system once and never returning. But 10.4 represents something extraordinary. The highest eccentricity ever recorded for any object passing through our cosmic neighborhood. Think of it like a stone skipping across a pond. Except this stone is moving so fast, it barely touches the water before launching into the air forever. The mathematics told an unambiguous story. The object was following what astronomers call an unbound trajectory, confirming beyond any reasonable doubt that it originated from interstellar space. This wasn't a long period comet returning from near cloud or an asteroid knocked out of the main belt. This was genuinely alien to our solar system. Professional observatories around the world immediately recognized the significance. The International Astronomical Union moved with unusual speed to officially designate the visitor as 31 Atlas, making it only the third confirmed interstellar object in recorded history. The Roman numeral three marked its place in this exclusive club of cosmic wanderers. While Atlas honored the survey telescope that first spotted it, the designation carried profound implications. Astronomers now had mathematical proof that objects from other star systems regularly pass through our cosmic neighborhood. Invisible messengers carrying information about distant worlds and alien planetary systems. But this visitor held even more surprises. Starting with its unprecedented speed through our solar system, 3E e Atlas is not just fast. It is moving at velocities that fundamentally redefine our understanding of interstellar travelers. At 66 kilometers slash as relative to our sun, it outpaces both previous interstellar visitors by significant margins. To put this incredible speed in perspective, you could travel from New York to Los Angeles in less than two minutes or circle the entire Earth in under 11 minutes. This extreme velocity tells a story of violent cosmic events that occurred millions of years ago in a distant star system. Objects don't achieve such tremendous speeds through gentle gravitational nudges or slow orbital decay. Something incredibly powerful ejected this visitor from its home system, launching it on an epic million-year journey through the cold darkness of interstellar space. The physics behind such extraordinary speeds involves catastrophic gravitational encounters with massive objects, close stellar passes, or even the violent death throes of stars themselves. When a massive star undergoes a supernova explosion, the tremendous energy release can fling nearby objects at incredible velocities, essentially turning them into cosmic bullets racing through the galaxy at unimaginable speeds. 
current astrophysical models suggest three atlas has been traveling through the vast emptiness of interstellar space for millions of years, possibly since before complex life evolved on Earth. During this enormous span of time, it has experienced the deep cold of the cosmic void with temperatures approaching absolute zero. While radiation from distant stars slowly altered its surface chemistry and structure, the object's incoming trajectory strongly suggests it originated from somewhere within the galactic disk, the flat plane where most stars in our Milky Way galaxy reside. This directional information provides tantalizing hints about a stellar encounter that occurred long before human civilization began when our entire solar system occupied a completely different position relative to neighboring star systems. What makes this record-breaking speed even more remarkable is that 3i Atlas shows no signs of slowing down as it approaches our sun. Unlike objects born within our solar system, which follow predictable elliptical orbits governed by solar gravity, this interstellar visitor will maintain its tremendous velocity throughout its entire passage. It will swing past the sun like a cosmic slingshot, gaining even more speed. Before racing off into the darkness beyond Neptune, the gravitational influence of our sun will bend the visitor's path slightly, but cannot capture it into a permanent orbit. Three, I Atlas carries far too much kinetic energy to be trapped by solar gravity. After its brief encounter with our star, it will continue its eternal journey through the galaxy, carrying with it whatever secrets it holds about its mysterious place of origin. This incredible speed also creates urgent challenges for astronomers hoping to study this rare visitor from another world. The number 6.3 will forever define three Atlas in the annals of astronomical history. This orbital eccentricity represents the most extreme trajectory ever documented by human science, completely dwarfing even the remarkable eccentricities of previous interstellar visitors like Oumuamua's 1.2 and Borisov's 3.4. Understanding orbital eccentricity requires thinking carefully about the fundamental shapes that objects can follow through space. A perfect circle has an eccentricity of exactly zero, representing the most stable possible orbit. Earth's slightly oval orbit around the Sun measures just 0.017. So close to circular that our planet experiences only minimal variation in its distance from the Sun throughout the year. Most objects in our solar system follow similarly predictable patterns. Even highly elongated orbits like that of Halley's Comet which stretches far beyond Neptune before returning every 76 years, reaches an eccentricity of only 0.967. These are bound orbits, mathematical curves that close upon themselves and repeat indefinitely. When eccentricity exceeds the critical value of one, the fundamental mathematics change completely. The object no longer follows an elliptical path, but instead traces a hyperbolic trajectory like the distinctive arms of a mathematical hyperola stretching toward infinity. At 6.3, 3 Atlas follows one of the most open hyperbolic trajectories theoretically possible, barely influenced by our sun's gravitational field. This extreme mathematical value provides crucial information of the object's violent past. Such extraordinarily high eccentricity typically results from close encounters with massive gravitational sources, catastrophic perturbations that accelerate objects far beyond their normal escape velocities. Think of a marble rolling peacefully around the edge of a bowl, then suddenly being struck so violently that it flies completely out of the container and across the room. The precise trajectory calculations also reveal exactly where three I Atlas entered our solar system. It arrived from the direction of the constellation Sagittarius coming from the general area of the galactic center where star density reaches its highest concentrations. This incoming path suggests the object may have encountered multiple gravitational influences during its long interstellar journey with each close stellar passage slightly altering its course through space. Astronomers can now predict with remarkable precision exactly where three Atlas will travel during its brief visit to our cosmic neighborhood. The mathematics show it will reach perihelion, its closest approach to the Sun on October 29th, passing just 1.4 astronomical units from our star. 
This distance places it safely inside the orbit of Mars, but comfortably far from Earth's position. Yet, this mathematical precision opens profound new questions about what cosmic violence created such an extreme wanderer. While professional astronomers focus their attention on current observations and trajectory calculations, amateur researchers were already quietly rewriting the entire discovery story of three atlas. The true heroes of this remarkable detection include ordinary people with extraordinary dedication to uncovering cosmic truths hidden in plain sight. Sam Dean, working methodically from his home computer setup, systematically began searching through archived Atlas telescope data spanning many weeks before the official discovery announcement. His patient persistence and careful attention to detail paid off spectacularly when he found clear, unmistakable images of the mysterious object from June 25th through 29th, extending the crucial observation timeline by several vital days. These pre-discovery observations completely transformed rough preliminary estimates into precise mathematical calculations. With additional data points spanning a much longer time frame, astronomers could dramatically refine the orbital parameters, confirming the object's interstellar origin with absolute mathematical certainty. What had started as tentative suggestions based on limited data became undeniable proof of an alien visitor. Other dedicated citizen scientists quickly contributed their own remarkable discoveries to the growing body of evidence.